All right, well, today is June 22nd, 22nd <laughs> 2013. It's my graduation party. Uh, everybody's starting to show up, and that's about it. <laughs> so, Daniel, oh how's the party so far? I wanted to say something so bad. <laughs> oh, my God, I wanted to say it's this is all I ever wanted. <laughs> Food's amazing, too. Yeah, I haven't tasted mine yet, but you know, got some meat, got some rice, and like the Filipino in me just wants all the rice. <laughs> <laughs> Your meat, I want all the rice. <laughs> crap, crap, crap. Go! Please, go. Shut up. Well, Daniel, win, win. Crap! No, no! Ha! I got cheated. Okay. Yes. I mean, his whole Damn. room blings in Spider-Man, Batman, uh, Superman. He loves him. He's, he's obsessed, okay? Yeah. His closet, he has a hundred t-shirts. I'm not kidding. A hundred. A hundred, okay? And green is his favorite color. Yes. He wore green. Yay! <laughs> So anyway, I'm going to keep this short and sweet. All I want to say is that, Daniel, you remind me of Batman because in the middle of the night, you're there for somebody and you're helping somebody in the middle of the night. You remind me of Superman because you are there for the family faster than a speeding bullet. Yep. And you remind me of Spider-Man because you're simply amazing. And that's all I need to say. Can I say something? Because of what Debbie said, I want oh. yeah, I want him to open this. Oh. So open that up. So after everything your mom said, I want you to open that. Open it up. Wait, 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 wait. Open it. Open it real quick. Open it. Watch out, she's gonna jump out of there. Oh, good tight. Where's the down? Show me. What is it? Thank you for all okay, you your. Oh. <laughs> we are alone. I want to stay. <laughs> you ever use grandma's voice? <laughs> I just want to say I want to thank Daniel for being there for my daughter to help her every night. They would stay up late. He would come over to my house and they'd stay up late at night. She would come over here and come home late and they would stay together. And I want to thank him for being there for her and helping her. And I'm so proud of him and her, but most of all for him pulling for both of them. He wanted to make sure that he did it for him and not just for him, but he did it for my daughter too. And that makes me feel good. Thank you, baby. I love you. And I will never forget you. <laughs> <laughs> I know we weren't close at first, but I'm really happy that we are now because you're my hero, you're my ace, you're my senior, you're one of us, I'm too. If I was you, I love her. If there's ever a problem I have, big or small, you're always there for me. I'm so thankful to have you as my cousin because I have no clue what I would do without you. You've helped me with so much and taught me so much. And I just want to say thank you. Woo! Friends, uh, family, um, Again, I just want to, you know, everybody said everything about Daniel. I, I really have nothing else to say other than, you know, he, he's, I, I seen him here. He's a, he's a hard worker. You know, something clicked in his head at one time. And, you know, I talked to him about going to college since right after high school. And, you know, he got a job and he kind of like faded away from that. And, and, you know, luckily did his uncle Albert kept showing him the bad ropes and, and he ended up getting cut loose from his job and actually that's 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 what changed his mind about going to college 
and and uh, and but you know once once he he set path and and he knew what he wanted and that's what he went for and, and I've seen this kid every day study he's he's very responsible I, I mean things that he takes care of that you know his his classes were coming first that, that he had to do he didn't want to go here or go there because he had to get something done uh, a test or whatever, and and uh, you know the the, the kid uh, just he accomplished everything he did in in, in at Delta, and uh, he 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 did it with with some high scores in his test, and and so you know on behalf of me and his mom, we just want to say that you know we're we're extremely proud of you, and uh, you know whatever it takes for you to get whatever you need to get done like I said I told all my kids I told Chris Steven all of them I said whatever it comes to education I said whatever I have to do I said you know I'll be there for your education if you want to do something or whatever I'll do what I can for you to get there and, and you know and luckily he took advantage of that believe me he took advantage of that and, uh, uh, you know I, I, I just want to say uh, uh, you know like like his his cake said, you know, he's amazing. So, again, I want to thank everybody for coming and, and, and celebrating this joyous occasion. And uh, thank you, Daniel. <laughs> well, as far as Chris goes, um, I told him before that I've always viewed him as a soldier. Uh, mm -hmm. That was even before he went in the army. Um, I think he's a very brave person. Um, I think he does what he feels is most important for him, which is something I think all of us should admire, uh, regardless of whatever decisions he's made in the past. Uh, he's a very strong and brave person, and I've always admired him for that. Um, and I respect his decision to, to leave and to move on and to try other things in his life. Um, I think that's another thing all of us can admire in him. Um, and I wish him the best. Um, and like my dad said, if things don't work out, he always has a home here. And I know I have a home here if I ever need to come back. Um, as far as Daniel goes, um, I was just telling him, the other day that um, he's always been a teacher to me. Um, so I think he's going in the perfect uh, profession. Um, since I can remember, I've, I've learned things from him. My younger brother, I'm supposed to be the one teaching him things, but he's, uh, he's, uh, he's, he's quite an incredible person. And, um, he sees things in a very different way than I think a lot of us do. And I think that's why all of us latch on to him so easily. And um, I think he knows us already, but I, I really believe that he's really one of the, the, the strongest rocks of this family. Because I think each and every one of us know that we can go straight to him no matter what's happening. And he will always be there for us. And because of that, we will always be there for him. And I'm very proud of him. And I know he will do great things, just like everyone else here knows. And I love you, and that's it. <laughs> All right, Daniel, uh, we, we were talking a while back, we're, like, and we've known each other for like, what, 17 years, 16, 17 years since fourth grade. We're both 26 now. And it's just, you know, I've known you like, you know, like more than half my life. Yeah, and it's just, I mean, you, like, you're just, you know, well, an amazing person, man. Well, oh. it's ultimate, but still. <laughs> Wait, I, no, that's amazing. Okay. Amazing. Right, right, right. I can't read I can't read cursive, remember? I can't read cursive. I mean, I mean, the, 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 there was that one incident in 2005 where something bad really happened to me. And like, I'm, I, I was really, I was really glad that, glad that, that, that you were there, you were there to, 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 to really pull me out of it and, and just, and just thank you, man. Just thank you for being in my life. Just thank you, man. Just Aww, thank you. sweetie. Aww. Aww. That's sweet, sweetheart. Way to go, Ruben. <laughs> uh, first and foremost, I want to thank everybody who came today. And 
I still want to say, you know, everybody is still in my heart who couldn't, who couldn't make it today. And I want to start off by saying that uh, it all began when I was having a conversation with Uncle Gabe. And he was telling me about when I was choosing where I wanted to go, if I wanted to be Oklahoma, or if, oh, yeah, or if I wanted to be, <laughs> or if, or if wanted to be Stanislaus. And he said, he said, Dana, when it comes down to it, don't think of anybody else but yourself. Just think of you when you make this decision. And I can say this honestly. I was hoping I had no other choice but to go to Stanislaus. Because it's you guys are me. I love you guys so much. It's moments like this that I absolutely live for. I would want nothing else but this every day if I could. You guys, you guys are me. I, there's never a bone in my body that wanted to leave. <laughs> never. And I just, I, I'm, I'm so happy that all of you made it. I love you guys so much. Thank you for everything. And just, I, I love you guys from the bottom of my heart. And just like Steven said. No matter what, I don't care if I was an OU or if I'm in Stanislaus, I'll, I'll be there in, in a moment's notice, no matter what you guys need. And I love you. Yeah. <laughs> the ice cream, dear. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, thank you, Tuna. Oh, there goes Spidey. Dang it. Well, it was a really good night. Uh, family's still here, so it's not completely over, but Ruben's calling her tonight. <laughs> And it was just a great time. Where have you been? Still here? Can't really explain it. Yeah, boy. Oh, they were rolling with the cops. So, what? that's it. They were rolling with the cops. <laughs> been great. Oh, boy. Boy, boy, hit that. Hit that. Shut up. Hit that. Get out. <laughs>